Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Anushka and before we begin today's video, I hope you have subscribed to my channel because you love English just like me. And if you have not yet subscribed, please do it right now and press the bell icon to stay updated with all of my videos. So let's start with today's video. I have mentioned it in my previous videos as well that improving English is a really slow process. It takes a lot of hard work, a lot of interest and a lot of time. So today I'm going to talk about six everyday tips to improve your English so that you can try them every single day to work upon your English. So let's start with the first one. Read English newspaper, which means begin your day with English. Your mornings can be made better if you start reading an English newspaper with your favorite cup of tea. It will help you understand how sentences are formed and will also make your vocabulary a little strong. So when you come across any difficult word or any word that is new to you, search out its meaning and read the sentence again. It will help you understand the meaning better. Keep looking out for word meanings. Just like my previous point, whatever content you read, be it a newspaper, be it any line in the television or in any pamphlet or anywhere on the board or any flyer, do understand the meaning of the words. And if you don't, if you come across words that are difficult or new to you, search out the meaning immediately and reread the sentence. It will help you learn it at the same time. Read out aloud and search for pronunciations. Start reading small paragraphs from anywhere, from any book, from any novel, from any magazine, from any literary content. It can also be newspapers. And the meaning that you come across of different words that are hard to you, that are new to you. Also check the pronunciation at the same time in any good online portal. Try to repeat it, try to read it aloud along with the pronunciation that you hear online and it will also help you understand how certain words are spoken. So that will improve your spoken English as well. Speak on a random topic with an expert who can be a spouse, who can be your friend, who can be your sibling. Like an extempore, speak on any random topic that they give you for one whole minute. No matter how many punctuation or grammatical errors you make, when you will be corrected again and again by those people, Unconsciously, your English fluency, sentence formation and flow will improve over a span of time. Be a part of mock interviews or question and answer sessions with your friend or sibling or spouse wherein they will be asking questions from you and you have to answer them. Just like extempore, it will again help you form sentences, improve your punctuation and grammar and fluency and within a span of time, your English will be getting better. Name, place, animal, thing. Remember our favorite game from childhood? That can even be utilized right now. Yes, if you play this game with an expert, that means a person who is better in English in comparison to you. It can be anybody like your friend, your sibling, your spouse. You can get to know a lot of words and a lot of spellings that you did not know before. Maybe there are some points that you miss out within a short span of time. You can learn it from the other person who noted down the accurate or correct thing. So in this way, your English will definitely get better. Update your electronic device language setting to English. If you use any electronic devices or language cues like Alexa or Cortana, you can update their settings to English, wherein you will be getting cues and giving them cues in English. And that will also help you understand how different words are spoken, how sentences are formed, and the cues will keep on going into your mind in not your native language, but in English. So this is another really good way to improve your English in a really subtle way. So guys, these were my seven everyday tips to improve your English. I hope you liked my video. And if you did, I'm sure you're gonna comment down there and tell me what you felt about the video. Do like it, do share it with your friends so that they even get to learn something new. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel and press the bell icon so that you receive the updates of all my future videos. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram. You can find the Instagram username on the screen. And yes, if you have not seen my previous video, you can find the link in the i button also in the description box down below. Till then, stay home, stay safe.